Hi guys, it's the Power BI guy here and today we're going to go over a very important function called calculate within DAX. Now this function is very important because what it allows us to do is change the way an expression or a measure is evaluated by adding additional filter context. Now you probably have no idea what that means and we're actually going to demonstrate what I mean by that and what calculate is actually doing as we want to understand the logic behind calculate so that we can start to build our measures and as we get more advanced it's important to understand these concepts. So without further ado let's start this lesson. So earlier on I mentioned that calculate allows you to change the way something is evaluated by adding additional filter context. Let's actually demonstrate that and understand what I mean by evaluation context and filter context. So let's take a look at this table over here. This consists of this column subcategory and then a total cells sum measure. I'm going to remove this table and let's take a look at the total cells sum. Currently in this state, it does not have any evaluation context. I can demonstrate this by putting this into a card and as we can see all this is right now is the total cells sum and it does not have any additional evaluation context. Now if I change this to a table and then bring in uh, the subcategory we can see this has now split our data that the total cells sum measure is being evaluated against all the different subcategories that we have. Now calculate allows you to add additional filter context to the way something is being evaluated in order to change the evaluation. So right now there is no additional filters, but what, what do I mean by additional filters? So let's say we wanted to see the total cells in the region West uh, against our subcategories. So this is our evaluation context right now. It doesn't have to be subcategory. It could just be category. That's a different evaluation context. Um, it could be state. These are all different evaluation contexts, but we want to see the cells in the region that are west. That is our filter context here. Let's actually demonstrate that. So let's go back to subcategory. Let's go back to subcategory and now add some additional filter context by using calculate. So what I'm going to do is create a new measure and call this total cell west. We're going to use calculate and then reference an expression or a measure. So we're going to use uh, total cells. And now, as you can see over here, it says filter. This is where we're going to add our additional filter context to the way total cells is going to be evaluated. So what I'm going to do is reference geography table and we want to see the total cells for the region west. So I'm going to do geography region equals west. And if I close that, oh, I've got, I've got a column already called that. Let's call it example. Let me bring that in. Now, if I bring this into our table, what we're going to see is that the numbers are different. The reason for that is calculate allowed us to add this additional filter context to the total sales measure. So now that it's being evaluated by our subcategories, we have that additional filter context of West. So we're saying whenever the total cells is evaluated, we want to filter that to the region West. So as you can see uh, right over here, that this is showing us the total cells for the West region. Now let's actually remove that and bring that into a card and demonstrate what we mean. So the original total cell sum measure had no additional filter context. And, it was, and it's not being evaluated by anything. So it's gonna give us the total cells sum. If I bring another card, which is the um, total cells West calculate, and let me change that to dollars, just for demonstration purposes, we can see that this is now showing us a different figure because we added additional filter context to our calculation. So that is only going to show us the uh, cells for the category uh, region west. And if we change this to a table and then add it in, let's say category, it is going to evaluate that against the categories, but we are now changing the way the evaluation works because we added the additional filter context of West. And it's important to understand that, that Calculate allows you to change the way expressions are evaluated 
via filter context. So for example, right now we are doing the total sales for West. I could do, instead of, um, let's say categories, let's do another calculation where we're gonna change it. So let's use this example. I'm going to put in date. So these are the order dates that we've had. And then let me remove this measure here and then put in our total sales. Now let's do orders. So right now, what we can see in this table is that we have our orders and then this is being evaluated against all our different order dates that we've had. Now, let's say we wanted to change the way our evaluation context here so that it's not showing us the orders in this date. We want to see the orders in the same period last year. That is in a different that is a different filter context to the way that this is going to be evaluated. So what I'm going to do here is if I go to new measure and then let's call this orders orders last year example we're going to use calculate the expression here so it was orders our orders measure and we want to now change the way orders is going to be evaluated by another filter context so in this case we're going to use same period last year and then reference the dates column uh, date where is that column and then if I close that and bring that into this table and then 2014 was our earliest year so we're not going to have any sales from in the previous year let me filter this what we can see that the calculate in this example now we have been able to change the filter context so that when the orders is being evaluated we're saying don't show us the orders for this year show us for the same period last year and that is due to the filter context that we've added the new additional filter context which is now changing the way that our measure